There's a feeling that uh, because of this significant... Well, this situation is back to the situation we unfortunately had in 1992. But in any case, I believe that uh, it should remain as a, a bilateral issue between Tbilisi and Sinwale, and assistance should be given from Russia, from the United States, from any other country, but uh, declaring things like it's just territorial integrity and nothing else, like Americans try to do right now, does not contribute much to the peaceful solution of the conflict because such a position, such an approach will be definitely rejected by Ossetians, by Abkhazians. The peacekeepers will stay in Georgia and uh, it is accepted by uh, Mr. Saakashvili and by the uh, French presidency in the European Union. So uh, the question is uh, about the Russian troops, which are to be withdrawn sooner or later. I hope it will uh, take place as soon as possible, but it will, of course, depend on how Georgian troops behave. And uh, as long we feel any theoretical, hypothetical threat coming from this Georgian force, I believe that the tempo of this withdrawal will depend on that. So Three pre-decided nations which should not. Mr. Saakashvili uh, is not trusted any longer either by Ossetians, nor by Abkhazians, nor by Russian, Russians living there. So I believe that uh, it's a mission impossible for Mr. Saakashvili to do anything more right now. He may be supported by the United States, he may be supported by NATO, but either it will be another war and uh, people living there, and we speak about tens of thousands and maybe hundreds of thousands of people, will be forced with military force to live together in an integral state. Saving human lives, it's about protecting civil population there, it's about protecting, among others, Russian citizens and...